a certain young man a rhetorician came to see epictetus with his hair dressed more carefully than was usual and his attire in an ornamental style whereupon epictetus said tell me if you do not think that some dogs are beautiful and some horses and so of all other animals i do think so the youth replied are not then some men also beautiful and others ugly certainly do we then for the same reason call each of them in the same kind beautiful or each beautiful for something peculiar and you will judge of this matter thus since we see a dog naturally formed for one thing and a horse for another and for another still as an example a nightingale we may generally and not improperly declare each of them to be beautiful than when it is most excellent according to its nature but since the nature of each is different each of them seems to me to be beautiful in a different way is it not so he admitted that it was that then which makes a dog beautiful makes a horse ugly and that which makes a horse beautiful makes a dog ugly if it is true that their natures are different it seems to be so for i think that what makes a pancratius beautiful makes a wrestler to be not good and a runner to be most ridiculous and he who is beautiful for the pantathlon is very ugly for wrestling it is so said he what then makes a man beautiful is it that which in its kind makes both a dog and a horse beautiful it is he said what then makes a dog beautiful the possession of the excellence of a dog and what makes a horse beautiful the possession of the excellence of a horse what then makes a man beautiful is it not the possession of the excellence of a man and do you then if you wish to be beautiful young man labour at this the acquisition of human excellence but what is this observe whom you yourself praise when you praise many persons without partiality do you praise the just or the unjust the just whether you praise the moderate or the immoderate the moderate and the temperate or the intemperate the temperate if then you make yourself such a person you will know that you will make yourself beautiful but so long as you neglect these things you must be ugly greek eiskron even though you contrive all you can to appear beautiful